Here's one of the great unanswered mysteries about the modern climate cult in America. Okay, on one hand, they say that carbon emissions are the enemy, that carbon itself is the enemy. Carbon is the source of global climate change, which, by the way, in the 1970s was supposed to be an ice age that was coming. About 40, 50 years later, it's now the opposite. It's global warming that's going to destroy the planet. And so you would think that a movement so committed to reducing carbon emissions, applying net zero standards by 2050, scope three emissions caps across the economy, a call on all of us to use less carbon in our daily way of life, you would think that this movement would embrace the best known form of carbon-free energy production known to mankind. That is nuclear energy. And yet you see a paradox. Many of the very people who are pushing the anti-carbon agenda in the United States are exactly the same folks who are also staunchly opposed to nuclear energy. Now, why is that? 